The Sioux Falls is filled with new businesses coming and going every day, many of them bringing a taste of a different culture to our landlocked state. In tonight's Your Money Matters, how the Multicultural Center of Sioux Falls is spreading the word about supporting more of these local businesses. Hello, Shalom Coffee House. Along East 10th Street in Sioux Falls, you can find a cup of coffee just like they make nearly 8,000 miles away in Ethiopia. I start from green beans. I roast it by myself in here. I ground it. I make it coffee in Jebana. We call it Jebana, the coffee pot. A few blocks further east on 10th Street, you can find another popular beverage that began 7,000 miles in the opposite direction. It's original from Taiwan. The owner of 9999 Boba opened this Sioux Falls store over the summer, sharing some of his unique creations with the community. Trying to figure out what's the best or how to get the best flavor out of it. Restaurants like Shalom give people in Sioux Falls a chance to learn a whole new culture, all from the comfort of their own city. Anyone can learn a lot about a culture and gain understanding by trying their cuisine. The Multicultural Center of Sioux Falls has started sharing some of these unique locally owned cultural cuisines you can find around town on Facebook. I wanted to raise awareness in the community of just the enormous buffet of many cultures um, that we have represented in our local businesses. Plenty of diverse options. And everybody's going to try different things and get used to it. That may just become your new favorite. Most of them, they say, this is my first time. That's why they say, after they try it, they love it. All while supporting local business owners who are thrilled to share a piece of their culture with their new community. I'm trying my best to make people happy, satisfying what, what I did. I tried both. They are both delicious. You can follow the Sioux Falls Multicultural Center's Facebook page for more links to the local cultural cuisines you can find around town. We have that link with this story on Kevaland.com.